Hello, this is the anti-natalist. We are the show that is being used and I'm born one in slave mind at the time. Our topic is, uh, what do I think about uh, shoplifters? I know that life is overrated, 96 made uh, the Im videos about that, but I'm going to make my own opinion or my input about that one. Shoplifting. In most cases, I don't blame them, especially the homeless ones. People are in poverty and unemployed, don't make money. The, the slaves, the, what I, the slaves, uh, I don't blame them. Uh, stealing uh, basic goods while the big company or corporation uh, make a hell of a lot of money stealing from uh, people stealing from wage slavery, the slaves owners stealing from the wage slaves. I don't blame them. I know life is overrated, says that. You know, it's got to laugh when people shop and lift. For me, I would laugh too. But as long as it's a basic necess necessity, needs, I wouldn't blame them. I would be laughing at the ma masters, the big company. Uh, when <laughs> if it's uh, something like Ferrari, Mustang, cars, those are unnecessary. Uh, home, I'm sure that uh, the child-free homeless slaves would, would not want that. It's, uh, it's unnecessary. The yacht, the flat screen TV, those are unnecessary. If it's a basic necessity, uh, I, the big company, uh, the, I uh, say corporation, the masters would de deserve it. But when it comes to shoplifting, the basic necessity, uh, it's, it's reasonable to me. I don't blame them. I will be, honestly, I will be laughing, laughing at the big company too. Even though I'm, I don't laugh much because I see life as it is, but it, it, it'd be a victory for us, the anti natalists Like life is overrated, I'm telling you, yes. Yeah, when, the thing is, when you work hard at insurance companies, the harder you work, it seems like the harder you work, the more you get kicked in the stomach. When you work hard at first, you're kicked in the nuts. Then the second you work hard, you got kicked in the stomach. And the third thing you work hard is you got you got kicked in the knee. You fell on the ground, and the and the massive stomp on uh, stomp it, stomp on you. That's what it feels like to work hard. All it's all lies. The hard you work, you will get something. But the truth is. In this corrupt system, you this you work hard, you you get uh, you uh, at the high target of being uh, getting skilled, stolen more. I don't know how else I work this out, but it it is. I know I know how the system works, but the breed that your breed kids does not seem to to care. Again, like I said in the previous video, mention the, the kids will work in the same wage slave slavery. That's why the point is that's why you shouldn't bring kids here in the first place. Your, uh, your kids will be uh, because of competition, overpopulation. You you can't achieve that dream in, anymore. Uh, there's no such thing as a so-called American dream, Canadian dream, Westerner dream anymore. It's not going to get you in anywhere because there's too too many people. It's way over should. Oh, we're talking over population, wage slavery, uh, more terrible people. Uh, you you can't. I guarantee that uh, when you bring kids in this world, your kids will not find a good job. You're not, you're, 
they're not going to find a better job. They're going to be stuck in the same old wage slavery. That I'm, I'm telling you. And when they work in the wage slavery, it can happen to any, anyone. It's a high probability that uh, your kids will end up being home homeless. Okay, I got to cross the street. The, the people don't realize that uh, people c c uh, it can unexpectedly become homeless. This uh, that uh, people they get on breathless, laterless. Look, tend to look at life in their own perspective. They don't see the perspective on on, on others. Uh, pe people unexpectedly got a surprise bill, end up getting get evicted and become homeless. And there was a homeless tent right here, like this. In the every season, every summer, you will or you will see a tent park here in the summer. Now they have been removed for some kind of e event. All right, that's um. The point is, we don't need any more people. Too too many people. The world does not need. Anyone to continue the bloodline? Uh, all my aunts and uncles, they are uh, late natalists. They all have ki kids. Uh, I just wish my first, all my first cousin, the best. I, I never. Um, people, you know, shepherds don't realize that everybody is different. Everybody sees life in the. Everybody sees life differently. We all have different perspectives. I'll catch you guys and girls with another one. On the outside, life is beautiful. But what people, what shepherds don't see is, there is the pointless, vicious effing cycle. Mm -hmm.